Okay, this is good. Corey, what do we got today for the beer train? We got high low, which usually it's high lie, which is a reference to an athletic event, and uh, now it's high low. And this is the IPA that I'm assuming is like a lower calorie? Lower ABV too. Lower ABV? 4%. 4% and then it's uh, 120 I see is a number on here. I'm not, it doesn't, I'm not sure if that's the calorie count. Do you see that, the real big right there? The I do. Right there? Yeah, it's 120 calories. I mainly know High Lie, like a lot of people from uh, my age bracket, from when Jackass yeah, went. Yeah, the oranges. Yeah, and got High Lies, uh, had High Lie players. It's the fastest sport in the world. Right. I didn't know that it was oranges. I forgot about that little fun fact. That's interesting. Yeah, from what I remember, that was a little a little more give to those than the balls they used. That makes sense. There might be like racquetballs that are hard and hurt. Yeah, they're real hard. <laughs> and uh, let's go ahead, let's shake up Chicago's finest. We want to make sure we get that sediment. Oh boy. This is uh, Jepson's Mallard, uh, is what my dad calls it. It's Jepson's Mallard. Jepson's yeah, Mallard. Um, wow, look at the, what a science experiment. Well, so you know what, if you're gonna take a shot, I'm gonna smoke some weed. All right, cheers. Cheers. If they ever change this label, I'm gonna jump off a <coughs> That label is so fire. Yeah. This is really good, by the way. This is really good. Uh, I like it, and just out of curiosity, what are we feasting on today? Uh, today we got Chicago, one of the most iconic frozen food and also restaurant brands in Chicago is Home Run Inn. Mm -hmm. And we got their uh, ultra thin crust sausage pizza, also known as sausage. I would say probably Chicago's number one pizza ingredient here is sausage. This city loves yeah. sausage. And uh, it's on this pizza. Indeed it is. Let's eat. Let's eat. Also guys, don't forget to like this video. I always forget, thank you. Uh, it helps the channel so much, so if you can't help in any other way, or you want to double help, hit that like button. It really helps the algorithm science. Please. Cheers. Cheers. Mmm. Oh wow. That is really thin, like the, the bread itself. What's the thing? I'm getting a good flavor, mm -hmm. and it's, uh, it's just way different than any other frozen pizza I got. Do you think it's the sauce or the cheese? I want to say it's the cheese. I think so too. And I'm digging it. It's just a really good pizza. Mm-hmm. I wonder how much this was. Do you happen to remember? I think it was $6.99. That's a good price for frozen pizza. I also think it might have been on sale. Home Run Inn is like always on sale. The sausages are okay. Yeah. Not the best I've ever had, but no. They do the job. They use a lot of them, which is good. The toppings a lot of the times on frozen pizza are like, I care more about the build of the whole thing. Like the- it Has a bigger impact. The crust and the cheese. Like this is just, everything's working together. Now I, these are pretty small, so I am gonna have a second one only because I wanna use Sixer sauce. His wife reaches for a slice and he just takes it and looks like you should have taken a bite. Go ahead. Too. Go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> no, you can have that. <laughs> no, you can have that. Mm. That's good with the Sixer sauce, y'all. The hotter Sixer sauce, I've noticed that on mm. pizza it really excels. You know what I do if I want to keep eating but I'm a little full? Binge and purge. I know about it. Nope. I, I just, I drink like three more beers and then the drunk food mm -hmm. mentality starts to sit in, and then I'm hungry again. Okay. This is a great opportunity for me to talk up one of my favorite. <laughs> I'm not sure if they heard that. Kylie just off camera. That's a fat boy thing to do. That's by my life. Right. I'm an inner fat boy. And that's a part of what I'm about to pitch here. One of my favorite things in the universe, mm -hmm. marriage and good sir. And here's a great point. You have to drink three beers to get to the point where you can feast more and, and have your uh, taste buds indulge in a wonderful dance. Right. That beers, every single one of those three beers, minimum you're talking like 90 calories. You're yeah. filling up. Some mm -hmm. people call those liquid, liquid sandwiches. You're, it's like it's like eating a little loaf of bread right there. That's true. Three whole beers. That's true. Weed, you smoke it, zero calories. Mm -hmm. Now, smoke going into your lungs is not a great thing for the health of you as a human. <laughs> no, but neither is chugging beers. Neither is chugging beers. <laughs> Three beers or a little uh, lung damage. Uh huh. Smoke a little weed and you can eat that pizza all you want. All of that checks out. I'm not happy about it. I'm not sitting here singing his praises, but it's all real. I wanted the plate away from me so I don't eat that last piece. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I had to bring her up or else she was gonna keep that. That's a cool skunk, man. How'd you domesticate that thing? <laughs> a lot of time and effort, dude. A lady? Like, bro, I want that sausage, bro. She's uh, motivated by food and drugs like her daddy. Mm -hmm. um, that was fantastic. What a fun video. Uh, before we go ahead and uh, thumbs up or thumbs down the pizza here today, and this skunk sprays me, <laughs> let's do a shout out. Merch shout out, merch shout out, merch shout out. That's right, ladies and gentlemen, we've got a merch short, and if you haven't noticed, 
this new shirt and the pint glass, number six with cheese logo on there, have gone live as of earlier this week. Monday of this week, those shirts went live to everybody. A lot of people already bought them from the Patreon early access, which was great. Um, yeah, if you if you guys haven't been to a merch store, you definitely need to check it out. Number six with cheese.com. Of course, we have a ton of other stuff. You guys saw us use the hotter six sauce on today's pizza. You can purchase that there. Really, just go check the store out. See what we got. A ton of awesome stuff. We're really stoked about this new shirt. And we give shout outs to anybody who buys anything. Here we go. Merch shot number one, Mr. Courtney Basinger. Woo! Love Courtney, one of the truest of G's of this entire web series. Very active in the Discord. Always just, he's a very like, making people feel good about life. I love Courtney. In this uh, specific order, he's ordered like everything. He got a koozie and a jump cut shirt. Courtney, we know you've bought a million things since then, but this is your shout out for this particular order. Courtney, thank you. And merch shout out number two goes to my good friend, Mr. Chris Protein. <laughs> Chris is a very, very old friend of mine from the military. Uh, great dude. He got himself two koozies, probably for one, one for him and one for his boyfriend. And uh, they live in Joliet, Montana. We sent those out to places. So I hope you guys are enjoying those. And uh, I miss you guys. I can't wait till the world's open back up and we get to hang out. He comes to Chicago sometimes. I got to meet Chris one time and he was the nicest guy in the world. Nice dude and I just want to hang out with him. He was wearing a jump cut shirt, so he looked very good. <laughs> of course, <laughs> duh. She wants sausage so bad. How long, like if it was Hunger, Hunger Games style, how long would she last in the like in the arena? She'd win it. She would? Yeah. Lionel would be one of the first ones to go. She's a vicious beast. <laughs> he would run to the cornucopia, trip, and get shot. All right, moment of truth. Eric McCluskey, our resident drummer on retainer. Drum roll, please. Thank you, sir. All right, thumbs up or thumbs down on whether or not you like to enjoy. You think the Sixers should spend their money on the Ultra thin sausage home run and pizza. Ho oh! I thought it was really good. That's a buy. I think the sausage could have been better. The sausage didn't really come into play on that with me. Like I didn't get a ton of the sausage flavor. Uh -huh. I know I th I feel like we recently had mm -hmm. a really good sausage pizza where the sausage was really good. I yeah, we've eaten a lot of pizzas, but that does sound <laughs> vaguely familiar. But I will say, even that like that being said with the sausage, hey, you gotta relax. That being said with the sausage not being the greatest. That cheese seemed really good to me, and I don't know why, but it was, it was. very good. I like the that. sauce was fantastic. Yep. And I thought that ultra thin crust crisped up well in the oven, and mm -hmm. I uh, I just like the way the crust turned out. So I thought all in all, still definitely a thumbs up. Let us the price. I agree completely. Let us know if you guys have ever had Home Run Inn. It's such a staple here in Jewel Osco's and Mariano's and Walmart's. Let us know if you've had Home Run Inn. It says Chicago like on the top of the box, like represent, dude. Uh, let us know. That's a that's a great one. And um, did oh you my, have any? You don't have any. Everything you said that? was perfect. Oh well, thank you. Wow. Why reiterate what was already perfect? I have very strong arms, <laughs> and they're not small. <laughs> <laughs> All right, man. Have fun in the comments. I'm gonna section get on this some one. tattoos on them. What do you? What's your first one? My first one, right here. Yeah. A little barbed wire going right around there, just okay. so you know. Like Pam Anderson. You, you fighting with me? Uh huh. You might get cut. Okay. Ooh, I like that. That's actually pretty good. You fight with me, you might get cut. I think I just threw my neck out. <laughs> sure. I'll have a drink. Don't bark. Go buy this plank, plank glass. We only bought like 30 of them. Oh yeah, those are pretty limited.